LeBron James' son, Bronny James, has been one of the brightest prospects in basketball in recent years. The 17-year-old has barely made his way out of high school, and practically all of the top college basketball teams are gunning for him. So where's Bronny gonna go next? Today, we'll be taking a look at that and more, so let's dive in. First, what are some of the colleges that are interested in Bronny? It's safe to say that practically every college in the world would be lucky to have the son of LeBron James on their basketball team. After all, good genes mixed with genuine talent are a recipe for success. Bronny is considered a four-star prospect for colleges for the class of 2023. He has received offers from almost every big college out there. In fact, he has been receiving scholarship offers ever since before he was a teen. But after proving himself on the basketball court, he received his first public offer from Ohio State, which was later reaffirmed by the college. Apparently, coaches in Ohio State would love to have Bronny on board since his father was born and raised in Ohio, although he didn't really play basketball for that college, or any college for that matter. But Ohio State isn't the only offer that the 17-year-old has gotten. Michigan was reportedly interested in picking up the second-gen player as recently as September of 2022. Jalen Rose pointed out that Michigan is currently coached by LeBron James's former teammate, Juwan Howard, and this would give Bronny an advantage. Oregon, UCLA, USC, and Memphis have also made offers for the young player. There's clearly no shortage of teams that are interested in Bronny, but it's still up to him to decide which team he wants to play for. Up next, where is Bronny likely headed? With all of these offers on the plate, Bronny has found himself in a situation that most young basketball players can only dream of, but the question of where still remains. Thankfully, Bronny also has access to certain resources that other basketball players don't, and that will certainly help him make the decision. As far as Ohio State is concerned, it's likely that Bronny is going to skip out on that offer. Why? Well, LeBron may have been an Ohio boy, but LeBron Jr. certainly isn't. Although he was born in Cleveland, Bronny has spent most of his life in either LA or Miami. This means that he's probably already more familiar with the basketball basketball scene in these two cities. Bronny has received offers from both UCLA and USC, and joining one of these colleges would mean he wouldn't have to move too far away from home. Both of these universities offer some of the best basketball facilities that money can buy, and since Bronny is already used to using some of the Lakers facilities thanks to his dad, we're sure he would only go for the best of the best. Coming up, Bronny hints at accepting Ohio State's offer. For the most part, Bronny has been completely silent on mentioning what college he wants to join after he graduates high high school. However, he was recently on a trip to Cleveland with his father, and there he had the opportunity to visit Ohio State, one of the colleges that offered him a spot on their team. When he visited, not only did the college extend the offer once again, but they also asked him to do an entire photo shoot in Buckeyes gear, which he gladly accepted. Bronny posted all of the photos on his Instagram page, and in the photos, he can be seen looking like he belongs there. At first, many people thought that this was a confirmation that the young basketball player had accepted Ohio's offer, but alas, nothing was confirmed. Bronny added a cheeky caption to the photo shoot, saying, Buckeye Nation, not committed. So even though he hasn't really committed to any team thus far, this is certainly the farthest he has gone when it comes to actually acknowledge a college. Although this photo shoot has excited a lot of Ohio State fans, it might also be a way of throwing people off and keeping them guessing what college he's actually going to join. Next, will Bronny James even go to college? Because he has received so many offers thus far, a lot of people are debating on whether or not Bronny James will be joining college. After all, being a part of a college basketball team has never been a prerequisite to joining the NBA. It has always been more of a recommendation. Bronny could very well join the NBA G League, which is the developmental league for the NBA. Here, talented basketball players, both young and experienced, can develop their skills enough before they're ready for the main league. It sounds like the perfect place for Bronny to start. However, Bronny's mother, Savannah James, has previously hinted that she wants her son to go through a collegiate process. She said that it would be really cool to see him start off his legacy through college since his father never really went to college. However, Bronny hasn't directly commented on whether he would prefer college or the G League. In all honesty, college has always been the more prestigious route for NBA players to take, and barring LeBron, if we take a look at some of the top NBA players in the world right now, most of them went to college. More recently, both LeBron and Savannah James confirmed that their son was leaning towards the college route, so that's likely the route he will eventually take. Up next, Nick Young says Bronny should go to USC. Nick Young is one of LeBron's LeBron James's favorite teammates, so it's not surprising that the 37-year-old is just as interested in the future of Bronny's career as his father is. Recently, he reacted to Bronny posing in Ohio State colors in a photo shoot. He said that despite everything that happened in Ohio, Bronny should stop thinking about that college 
and go to USC instead. Young says that USC has many advantages that Ohio simply doesn't. For example, if he stays back in California, he'll always be close to his father and family in general. All of his friends and family would be able to attend big games, and that'll certainly give him the moral boost he needs to put up amazing performances and increase his value when the draft inevitably happens for him. To end things off, Young also came up with a nickname for LeBron Jr., calling him Swaggy Brawny. But overall, even though there are a lot of options, it seems like Brawny is going to have to make a decision between two big colleges. He either plays in Ohio for the prestige and the heritage, or he plays in USC to be closer to his friends and family. Either way, he can't really go wrong. Coming up, Brawny entering Memphis seems more and more likely. With all the talk about Brawny joining either Ohio State or USC, there's one college that people are seriously ignoring from the conversation, Memphis. Basketball journalist Jason Munns recently wrote an article on the three reasons why Brawny might just join Memphis, and the points he brings up are pretty valid. For starters, Memphis is a prime destination for every up-and-coming basketball player due to Penny Hardaway. He's the current coach of the basketball team, and he's widely considered the best developmental coach in the world right now. In recent years, he has been responsible for the successes of some big names like Quentin Grimes and RJ Hampton. LeBron has also praised Hardaway's abilities numerous times in the past, and that can certainly play a big role in Bronny's eventual decision. Another reason why Bronny might enter Memphis is Nike. Both Hardaway and LeBron James are some of Nike's biggest brand ambassadors. If Bronny could potentially ink a deal with Nike before his career starts, they would want him to be their high-profile coach as well. And the third reason why Memphis might just be the best college for Bronny is Ashton Hardaway. Ashton is Penny Hardaway's youngest son, and creating a dream team in college would increase both of these players' value by tenfold when they eventually make it to the NBA. Joining Memphis would be a great strategic move for Bronny, but we'll just have to wait and see if it ever materializes. And finally, could Bronny and LeBron play together one day? Even though a lot of people are excited about Bronny finally playing on a college team, some people are even more excited about the prospect of the young player joining his father on the LA Lakers. Nick Young recently said that as long as LeBron James is in the Lakers, anything is possible, and Bronny could certainly make his way on the team in the next few years. On top of that, if Bronny enlists himself in the next NBA draft, the Lakers might just pick him up to secure LeBron's future with the team. After all, they can't just lose the most valuable player in the NBA, so giving up a spot for his son won't be that far-fetched. However, since Bronny hasn't exactly proved himself yet, he will likely be a late pick during the first round of the draft, and that's not the kind of start he might want to have in his career. That's a wrap for this video. Do you think Bronny will be a big star in the NBA? Let us know in the comments below. As always, don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel for more videos like this. See you in the next one.